right now our stick figure simply moves from left to right across the screen. We'd like to add a more complicated path to his motion. To do this, I'm going to go back to frame one, and I'm going to click on the Add Motion Guide button here. It's going to add a new layer, and we'll see that layer one is indented underneath it. This motion guide applies to layer one. I'm going to click on frame one for the motion guide layer, the layer with the red dotted line. And using the pen tool, I'm going to draw a line that represents the path that my animation is going to take through the screen. You see, it's sort of zigzagging around and ends up on the right side. What I can do now is I can take my stick figure. You see, see how he has this little red little circle in his center now? If I take that and let, grab, him, grab him by that circle, he latches onto the end of my motion guide. And if I, at the other end of this, latch his circle on, the other end of the motion guide. So this red line is basically following, the path this circle is following through our timeline. So frame frame one, the circle is at the beginning of the line. Frame 30, the circle is at the end of the line. My key, my, my figure will now follow that line through 